Uh, hi, I'm uh, Jim Lake, and I just would like to talk to you a little bit about this uh, collection of Irving Berlin, who is one of the great masters, the great American songwriters of uh, the 20th century. And uh, the first piece in the book is called Alexander's Ragtime Band, which is a classic in that it was written in 1911 and it's over 100 years old and still popular uh, as a piece and so uh, I think the students would enjoy the arrangement of this. Uh, it's a nice arrangement for uh, piano students, uh, not too difficult but uh, very rhythmic and uh, a touch of nice harmonies I don't always stick with just, you know, basic harmonies, but I try to jazz it up a little. A Pretty Girl is Like a Melody was written for the Ziegfeld Follies way back probably in the 20s. And um, it's, uh, it's a gorgeous tune, uh, still very popular, uh, especially at fashion shows. And uh, uh, again, it's uh, you know a little touched up with modern harmonies uh, than it was back in those days. You know, say it with music is an interesting uh, piece because in this arrangement, it starts out with the left hand, with the left hand playing the melody, and the right hand has rhythmic chords which have to be subdued because the left hand is what the melody is and needs to be prominent. So it's a challenge for students uh, to learn how to balance their, the hands and make one come out and one softer. Play a Simple Melody is uh, one of Irving Berlin's daughters described as a uh, double tune. Uh, the, the, the melody is, won't you play a simple melody? Uh, and then later on, there's uh, this part that goes, da 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 And so I have the, the student play the first part, the second part. I do not have them combine both parts, but that's, that's uh, what uh, singers do. So that, so that one singer is pl uh, singing, won't you play a simple melody? And the other is, da 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 you know. So anyway, it's what his daughter called one of those double songs. Um, You'd Be Surprised is a uh, wonderful tune, uh, very rhythmic, has lots of syncopation in it. And I'll never forget, there was a big uh, Carnegie Hall tribute for early Berlin, and Madeline Kahn sang this song, and you know, comic that she is, she just brought the house down with this, uh, uh, because of the lyrics, which are, the lyrics are there, and you, you will see uh, the comedy in it if you look at the lyrics closely. I mean, uh, that is to say it can be taken many different ways, you know. <laughs> I Love a Piano was, according to Irving Berlin, his favorite of all favorites. Um, and it's, it's, a, it's a marvelous uh, tune. Uh, it's got uh, a lot of uh, chromaticism in it that moves by half step that is uh, really unique and wonderful. And uh, it's, uh, you know, I th it was written in 1915, and, and it's still, you know, very popular today. Michael Feinstein sings it on lots of programs. Say it with music. Eleven Irving Berlin songs.